Well, that was a bit of a lackluster intro there. <laughs> uh, what's up, everybody? My name's Hugh Miller, and today I have uh, a bit of a redo walkthrough. I, I recorded a walkthrough for this game uh, a couple years ago, but today we're doing it in a different fashion. We have one of the people that actually worked on the game, uh, who wrote the game, and who was the... You know what, let's just let him introduce himself. Today we have Robert Riedel joining the walkthrough. How's it going, Robert? It's going good, Hugh. Um, thanks for inviting me to uh, do this strange walkthrough through a part of my life. <laughs> um, uh, like I said, I, I haven't seen this game in, uh, since it came out, maybe a couple <sighs> years after that. Um, Unreal. Um, but uh, yeah, so it's, it's interesting seeing the stack of books once again and that, <laughs> that looping theme right um, um but uh thanks for the opportunity to to do this and uh hopefully it'll be interesting for all parties involved absolutely well i'm super stoked to have you on this is uh this has been a dream of mine to have a her interactive employee or even past her interactive employee on the show as we as we do a walkthrough and uh yeah, so the reason we're doing this game is this is the first full game that Robert worked on, and this is the first game that I ever played in the series. So, a bit of firsts, and uh, yeah, we'll just we'll dive in. We'll see how it goes. We're going to hear a lot of cool stories, and I tried to get webcams working, but my webcam wasn't working, which is why you're just seeing the game, but that's okay. So let's do this. So here we are on the, uh, the main menu. Ooh, listen to that scratchy music. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Well, they actually, so they really, Her Interactive released the soundtrack, like an HD version of the soundtrack, like, I don't know, 10, 12 years later uh, or goodness. something. Yeah, I know. Uh, so the whole, all the audio in the game is, is very, it's very staticky. So I'll be diving yeah. through that. Yeah, uh, Kevin, uh, Kevin was not happy with that at all. It was just, <laughs> it was, it was so sad to take his wonderful pieces and, and squash it down to <laughs> scratchy four bit or eight bit. I don't know what. what. <laughs> um, uh, well, it's the the tracks when they're listened to in HD are absolutely beautiful. So we'll have to do that. Listen to that later in uh, homage to him. Uh, are we playing on junior, senior, or master detective? Uh, you know, I have not played for so long. I think we're gonna have to do junior. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry. No, I play on junior all the time. Uh, it's all good. Dear best. You'll never guess who I'm visiting in New York. I don't know. Maddie Jensen, your favorite soap <laughs> oh. star from Light of Our Love. Ooh. Maddie is <laughs> of Our Love, I love that. In New York. Oh. And after hearing about my last case, Secrets Can Kill, Maddie called to invite me up here. Yeah, because Secrets Can Maddie, Kill is like Nick everywhere Arden in the is getting death threats. Right. <laughs> he won't go to the police. Oh. So she wants me to do some investigation work. Can you imagine anyone not liking Rick Arlen? Daytime's yes. cutest hunk? I have a sneaking suspicion <laughs> though, that there's more wrote to that. this case uh, than <laughs> So many years ago. I, Nancy. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, so here we are in New York. Like, I, I hadn't even been to New York before. Oh, uh, really? So Laura Henyon, our, uh, I think, creative director, art director at that time. Um, she was really the, Hi, the, the, the lead open. on this. So, um, so it was definitely her, like, New York homage since she came from New York. Oh, okay. Bronx or something. Oh wait, so what's it? Uh, wait, wait, wait. But who said it was open? That's weird. Oh, that, so that was Maddie. So we're at Maddie's okay. apartment right now, uh, or I guess Aunt Eloise's apartment that Maddie's staying at. Um, oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah and Aunt so Eloise has a brown stuff. exactly. Yeah, and so this is Maddie's note to us saying that while you were out, Ned called. He asked me to tell you to call him the first chance um. you got. By the way, he sounds cute. I'm just I'm just just distracted with all the Andy aliasing on the cursor. Sorry. <laughs> uh, welcome to the 20th century. Right. Oh uh, <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, that's so that's one thing that we'll get to do uh, later in this game. The thing that makes me laugh the most is how he pronounces River Heights. It's not River Heights. It's River Heights or River. Oh, how does he pronounce? It's just the way he does it. It's it's brilliant. How Ned does it? How Ned does it? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Uh, and there she is. Yeah. Is Welcome it? to New York, yep. Nancy. I'm really glad you could come out here on such short notice. So Lonnie was the voice director um, with Megan. Right. And, and I had to be there because I sadly wrote the script. <laughs> and I and I think yeah, Lonnie got all of her. She got her peeps. So this is the last time that we we had the uh, um, outside Seattle talent. Okay. 
Uh, all right. This was the first time we went with 3D characters. Right. Yeah, because before it was just the 2D hand-drawn animations. It's not all that exciting. Five a.m. shoots, a million lines to learn, people all uptight and yelling, and now Rick's getting these death threats. It's, it's that the actual performance, like it's all chopped, it's not syncing. Is that? I think that's. Uh, I think that is. Uh, it, okay. As I'm I don't know if it's like. A, well, as I'm screen sharing, there might be a bit of a lower frame rate. I'm oh, not, got it, got it, I'm got not it. Too got sure. It. Yeah. But it can't be all that bad being a star. I think I, un I think I yes, unchecked can be all that uh, bad. frame rate limit. If Rick so. leaves the show, Light of Our Love could be in a lot of trouble. Everyone's worried that the show could uh -huh. get canceled. There's well, the trouble. The yeah, threats. that's it. Well, for the past month, my co-star Rick Arlen has been getting these awful death threats. She's she had to repeat herself about Rick Arlen because we didn't know how people get into this conversation. Right. Okay. Since it was all interactive, <laughs> multi-treed. Weird. They're Weird. totally bizarre. Not only did he get letters, but somebody sent him a box of poison chocolates, a broken watch. Suppress the chocolates. And then there's that That's the one which the came telegram. back later in uh, the Phantom of Venice. Oh uh, yeah, because it was uh, Italian. Spanish. Yeah, exactly. I mean, surprise. I gave it away. Oh, really? Oh, uh, interesting. Um, uh, so, the funny thing about this is that I think the only time you can select uh, what was the watch uh, or broken watch about is right now. If you don't, interesting. I think if you don't select it now, you never hear this line again. Or you can never get this option. Again, it was the whole, like, thrill of interactivity. Someone like, oh, you could go down a, a, a path that no one else will. Right. Right, yeah, of course. Running out. And and really I think Maddie like out. cuts the cuts the convo short, so something yeah. that's supposed to be suspicious. Did Rick go to the police? Yeah, exactly. No, yeah. and that's the problem. No one is taking any of this seriously. Even the teleprompter Especially option's Rick. gone too, actually. He thinks nothing will ever hurt him. Tell me about the letters. Well, the first ones had the letters cut out of magazines, you know, like on a ransom note. They were all signed by someone named B.T. Kaiser. B.T. Kaiser. Somehow the news leaked yeah. out and the press What's, totally jumped on Wait, him. that's supposed to be like a... Then they started getting ugly. It's supposed to stand for something. It's an Someone's acronym or something? Poison chocolates? Oh, uh, that's... that's so that's that's a different name. We'll come across that name uh, a bit later in the game. Candy. Yeah, but These it's... It's a... So nasty, it's a, like a... Them out. <laughs> anagram for something. I've never seen Rick say no to chocolate B.T. Kaiser? Before. Nancy, I'm running late. I need to get to the studio. Oh. Brush up. Hey, why don't you come over and visit? I'll leave a visitor's pass for you at the security desk. Oh, oh before I forget, Mr. Guardino. Of the house yes. I'm always losing my keys, so Ralph. I've got plenty of copies. I'll write the studio's address on your map. Just catch a taxi cab outside and show them the map. They'll know how to that was there. an issue for reviewers. They're like, Nancy's taking all these taxi cabs over, all over New York. Oh, you know, really? How can she afford that? Like, how can how can she afford anything? Oh, isn't there? Yeah, yeah. See yeah, the eye. There's a little that, eye there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's and then that's very. Yeah. Go ahead. If we click here, then it's just it's just gone. That's oh. Right. Yeah. It's freaky. <laughs> yeah, that's very Laura Henyon touch. Is you know, that right? It's hey? like weird. Yeah, because she put in all the m weird messages and secrets can kill. So she was oh, very okay. much into, you know, putting this the weird um, kind of symbols and blah blah blah. Right. Okay. And again, like these were red herrings. They, this this was always the fight that I had was like, you know, why are we putting in? Oh, she crossed out deer. Oh, it's just simply Rick. Oh, and she inserted a lifetime of. But when, she's oh, gonna you... send this to him. Like she'd he'd still see like it was deer. Yeah, I know. Like... Oh, and uh, also the don't know and truly. Oof. I don't know what that word is. Both. Is this supposed to be a clue or something? Don't know more scared or something. Is there supposed to be something hitting him? Don't know. Uh, I don't know. know. But yeah, yeah. Again, this very Laura Henyon touch of you know these these kind of strange clues that don't seem to be sorry that's my fault it's going to be locked for the remainder of the game <laughs> um i think it just had like tear, torn up newspapers or torn up well so that's yeah that's actually the um oh i'll just back out of here so if we 
I won't do it right now, but if we actually open the little cheat menu, that is how we can oh. get the key to open this. Cheat menu? You're not supposed to know about that. Oh, well. Um, I guess I, I guess uh, cat's out of the bag. Yep. Um, 